Jonna Moynanen. I'm the Vice President at Nickel with RNC Minerals and uh, proud to be the STEAM stream chair for the operations section for CIM 2019 conference. This year, the format for the CIM uh, 2019 convention is, is a bit different. Um, we're really trying to embrace a one CIM philosophy uh, with, the, with the idea that we're all part of the mining industry, we're all part of CIM, and uh, instead of being broken into individual streams, uh, such as in the past. So in the past, there would have been a stream on um, underground mining, a stream on surface mining, a stream on uh, geotech, a stream on processing. This year, under the operations stream umbrella, we're including abstracts from all of those uh, within various sessions. So things are much more integrated this year. And I think for the operational companies and the mining companies that are attending, uh, they're really going to enjoy the sort of more integrated format where they can go to different sessions based on their specific topics, um, but they're also integrated into a larger overall picture. So the paper selection this year was a bit different because uh, we're really uh, looking at this one CIM philosophy. Um, we've been able to take all of the abstracts from the operations stream that were submitted and have the input from the various societies. So while I'm the overall operations stream chair, we've had each society uh, go through the abstracts and select abstracts that would be a focus for their and an interest to their specific members. And then each one of the societies has been able to come in, select their abstracts, um, propose session chairs, and create smaller sessions within the overall stream to target their membership. So in terms of specific case studies uh, that we'll be, a, that we'll be uh, presenting, uh, if we look at one of our sort of the data-driven opportunities, we're gonna look at one how uh, Lean, lean data transformed an operation in terms of how they were able to integrate that data and improve their operation. Uh, we're going to look specifically around case studies, around commissioning, uh, some of the new projects that are within Canada so I and, and around the world. Um, so I think these ones specifically will be of interest uh, to many of the operators out there looking at how to into implement some of these uh, improvements into their own operations. When I look at the abstracts that have been spitted, one of the things, uh, one of the themes throughout these abstracts really were around um, automation, specifically uh, data, how to, how to get all of this data that we're starting to generate, that we've been generating for years, and really use this data uh, to be able to make decisions. The computing power is caught up, the technology is caught up, and how do we um, take that technology and apply it to our minds and our operations? Um, I think that's gonna be a big theme this year when we look at the abstracts that were submitted um, definitely that's sort of all the way through people want to talk about how they're using that data and putting and, uh, and improving their operations. Some of the more exciting new topics that are coming out of course battery electric vehicles. Um, you know everybody's talking about how we're going to be able to put battery electric vehicles to improve the cost in our mind, improve the air quality in our minds and uh, we actually have a full session dedicated to uh, battery electric vehicles and, uh, and mining. I'd like to welcome everybody who's watching this to come and join us and join myself in Montreal. Uh, this 2019 CIM convention is running from April 28th to May 1st, and it's going to be a really exciting time. I've been uh, a member of the CIM for 20 years now. I started as a student back in 1997. And, you know, for me, coming to this convention is not just around um, attending the amazing technical sessions and, and learning a pile of new things and how do I can apply those to my operations. It's, as, it's also uh, reconnecting with colleagues and friends. So I hope you're able to join me and we'll see you there.